Let me play the fool! <laughs> With mirth and laughter, let old wrinkles come, and let my liver rather heat with wine than my heart cool with mortifying groans. <sighs> Why should a man whose blood is warm within sit at his grandsire cut in alabaster, sleep when he wakes and creep into the jaundice by being peevish? <sighs> I'll tell thee what, Antonio. I do love thee, and it is my love that speaks. There are a sort of men whose visages do cream and mantle like a standing pond, and do a willful stillness entertain, with purpose to be dressed in an opinion of wisdom, gravity, profound conceit, as who should say, I am Sir Oracle, and when I open my lips, let no dog bark. My dear Antonio, I do know of these that therefore are reputed wise for saying nothing, when I'm very sure if they should speak would almost damn those ears which hearing them would call their brothers fools. I'll tell thee more of this another time, but fish not with this melancholy bait. For this fool got ye in, this opinion. <laughs> Come, good Lorenzo, fare you well a while, and I'll end my exhortation after dinner.